Mike Shore, Prosper Trading Academy, joins us now for his day trade. Before we get to that, let's get your Prosper market perspective on the overall conditions. Yeah, uh, you know, everything is just hinging on U.S. U.S.-China trade talks. I mean, you know, every tweet, every interview, that's what's moving the market. Uh, it's all it's all innuendo and very nuanced and everything, but the market is very slippery. Lots going on here. Let's take a look at your day trade. What do you see happening? Yeah, so I'm looking at Tesla, and there's a really interesting technical setup in Tesla that uh, if we get above the 294, so like 294.01, literally, that is my trigger to get long Tesla. So I'm gonna go out and I'm just going to do this Friday's options. Why am I doing this Friday? Two reasons. One, if this signal is going to work, it's going to work very quickly. And if it's not going to work, I want to get out quickly. So I'm going to put out as little premium as I can so I can leverage myself even better. Second reason that I'm not going out to next Friday is that earnings are on the 30th, which means I'm going to be paying for premium that I'm not going to use because I have no intention of taking this through earnings. So what I'm looking is for this Friday, the 305, 310 call spread, I want to buy that for 90 cents. Now the measured move is only out to 309. So I'm not going to, I'm not going to kid myself and think that I'm going to get like seven to one on this trade, but I am getting more than five to one if we get to 309. Good to note about that premium because this is traditional and options trading the contracts, the options contracts tend to become more expensive the closer you are to that earnings date. Absolutely. Implied volatility will go up. Uh, you know, it's not sneaking up on anybody, but kind of the premium is locked in for maybe three, four days beforehand. And that tends to be just because so many people want in on the trade. So a lot of big time traders are, are fine with paying that higher price and they yeah, hope to win big too. They're gonna pay for they're gonna pay for that gamma. So they're they're gonna buy that short term option. Short term implied volatility will go up faster than the other implied volatilities they're going to go up as well but that time structure is going to is going to get in what we call a backwardation good to have you here and great trader lesson thanks for having me check out businessfirstam.com to find out where to see our entire show and don't forget to like follow and share business first am